What's up guys, Shane here with Figure Deck 3D Printing, and I'm back, and we've got little Madeline here with me for today's episode, so let's get started. Welcome back guys, so as I said, I am finally back for my paternity leave, and here we have little Madeline, who we had on July 5th, and I had a good two months hanging out with her and the family back home, but now I'm back and it's time to get back to business. So what's been going? When I went on to paternity leave, there was a whole bunch of you guys that decided to band together and buy me a 3D printer. And for that, I thank you. I worked on it pretty much all summer long. I did tons of mods to it, but sadly it couldn't fit in my suitcase to come back, so I had to mail it. I'm gonna do a separate video just on thanking you guys, and I'm gonna show you the different mods that I've done to it. I think it came out great. I'm getting pretty good prints off of it, a little more tuning I need to do, but there's a lot more mods that I wanna to do to it as well. Another thing I wanna address real quick is the Hypercube, you still see it here in the corner. I have not worked on it, but down below me, I received all the electronics that I need, all the screws, the threaded rods, the steel rods, the carbon fiber rods. So now that I have everything, hopefully sooner rather than later, I can get started on that build again, but my laundry list of filaments to review and other things that companies have sent me to review do take precedence on that. Uh, I put their gear that they send me over my own personal projects. So that's gonna have to wait a little bit, but I do plan on continuing it as soon as possible. Another thing a lot of people have been asking about is the MakerBox videos. And of course, because I was on my leave, I didn't really have the, the MakerBoxes delivered to me. So they all came here to my house and they're both sitting right over there. And hopefully I can print with those real soon. There's some really cool filaments in there that I wanna test out. Cork fill is one of them, I'm excited for that. So hopefully that again will be some videos that record very near future. So I will catch up for the June, July boxes. Hopefully I can get the both of those done before the August box finally gets to me in about a week or two. So I'm gonna be down to the wire on that one. So that's where a lot of my time is going to go here in the next week or two. Uh, I want to get the CR10 built so that I can actually start printing some of the reviews on it. Another working printer means more reviews that I can knock out, means more filaments I can test at the same time, which is all good news. That way my backlog is not huge. I think I have eight or ten companies that sent me filaments over the summer that I have to get to. Uh, I have some videos on YouTube that I didn't publish. You guys didn't get anything in the past like two weeks because dealing with traveling and jet lag for three kids has been brutal. You know, the, the 3 a.m. mornings are not really kind and I'm not really in any condition to be filming, but I will get those other videos published very, very soon. And that's gonna wrap it up. Maddie's yawning, it's almost bedtime here. I'll get this edited out to you guys real soon. So stay tuned and you guys know the drill. If you wanna help me out, there's Patreon, the link's down below. I'll link some other videos here for you guys to check out. So do all that and until next time, happy printing. And as soon as I'm done recording, you decide to look. Great, thank you. You've been a big help.